welcome back uh, so uh, in this current tutorial uh, we shall learn how to extend the logical volume online okay so in my last tutorial if you have seen it uh, we learned how to create a logical volume how to create volume uh, physical volume and uh, volume group and we also learned to uh, uh, make a file system and use it you know online okay so in this current tutorial we are going to uh, extend the logical volume size okay so we we will be so the, so the file system is already mounted on a target and it is of certain size now we have a requirement that uh, we need uh, 1 GB or 500 MB extended okay so uh, we can do that online without uh, altering the without uh, hampering our work okay you can continue your uh, work in the file system so that's the purpose of uh, uh, you know LVM that you, uh, you can do online resizing and extending and reducing okay uh, so so first of all we are going to check how much space we have in physical uh, in our volume group once we have once we uh, see that okay we have enough space we can extend the logical volume we can go ahead and extend the logical volume using the LV extend. Okay, so we'll do it with a live example. Okay, so just watch it carefully, and uh, if you have any questions, you can definitely ask in the comment section. Okay, so here is my current setup, uh, which is uh, so this is my LVM like that we have discussed earlier, and this is mounted on a target MNT mount point two. Okay, so the current size is. Uh, 477 MB and uh, like we we want to extend this okay so you see this mount this is already mounted and we are using it you know and uh, at the same time the, let's say that this became full or uh, you know you, you want it to you want it to extend okay so how do we do that so of course we can do this using the online resizing which is provided uh, in LVM Okay, so first of all, what we do is we will we will check the available space. How much space do we have in our cake in our volume group? Okay, so this is our uh, volume group, so VG1, and the total size is 968 MB, and uh, so so currently we have already allocated 500 MB and we have 468 MB left okay so of course we can extend the, our logical volume by uh, 468 MB okay that's all we have at this moment okay so this is just an example let's say you have a 10 GB drive and your uh, volume group says you have 5 GB more left so you can definitely make your LVM from 10 GB to 15 GB okay so let's do this okay so what you need to do is so so while extending the uh, uh, logical volume you don't need to unmount it okay you can directly do it uh, and you won't lose any data that's the benefit of LVM okay so what you have to do is you have to uh, check first of all uh, check the uh, manual of uh, uh, LV extend okay so it's, it extends the size of logical volume it allows you to extend the size of a logical volume extension of a snapshot logical volume for information to create snapshot is supported as well okay so this is uh, online resizing okay so we, we at any point you you you, you feel like you you, are, you don't know the syntax you can refer this menu in manual okay so all you have to do is lv extend lv extend and then so uh, uh, there are two ways one is lowercase l one is uppercase l so uppercase l you have to give the exact size you want to increase with so let's say i want to increase with uh, 460 mb okay and then you have to give the uh the lv name okay so you have to give the lv name so lv name it you should have to specify the path of lv okay so this is your current lv which we are, we have already mounted and the current size is 500 mb and we want to extend it to let's say 900 mb or 900 whatever available till the max capacity okay uh, so what we can do is we can do lv extend and then minus capital L plus we have 468 MB space available in my volume group so I would say 460 
we can do till 8 also let me check uh, 468 MB okay and then you have to give the LB path okay so I would just copy it and paste it okay so this is my LV path okay so you see what is happening size of logical volume change from 500 MB to 968 MB okay so now we have used the volume group at its max capacity so now if I uh, do this LV display so it should be showing me the uh, uh, the extended size which is 968 MB now if you do VG uh, display it won't it, 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 it won't have any available space in it okay so you see there is a in the available space is zero okay you can also check in VG display okay so you see now uh, the total physical extend is 242 and all of them are located and we do not we do not have any available uh, free physical extend okay but then what what about our file system it is still showing as the earlier value right so so we need to resize we need to resize the uh, the the file system okay while extending okay so we did not unmount it okay so the file system is still mounted okay we, that's that is the uh, key point here to, to notice okay so uh, resize file system and now we are going to resize the file system resize FS minus F okay and then um, we have to give the file system name which is this one okay uh, so you see <clears throat> now the file system at this is mounted to this online resizing required of course we are doing online resizing so the file system is now 99,000 right 9 lakh 91,000 whatever KB so now if you see DF minus H you should see the size of LV it is increased from 477 MB to 930 MB okay so you have done the work you have extended your LV online you know without uh, you know uh, um, hampering your work your, your 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 file system is still mounted and you can directly go and make use of it and you can work on it okay so this is how it happens guys and if you have any question please watch uh, please uh, please uh, uh, don't hesitate to ask and uh, uh, thanks for watching and please uh, of course if you like it uh, because I put a lot of efforts to make such videos and uh, it should be helpful for all of us okay so please subscribe and share with your friends and uh, thanks for watching. <coughs>